hello guys welcome to bms crypto youtube channel so today we're going to be talking about the metamax edge of guide i'm going to be doing the video on metamax edge of guide so basically we do airdrops cryptocurrency DeFi analysis and the more the rest of it on this youtube channel so you can also hit the subscribe button comment below give the thumbs up share the link to your friends so that will always so come and enjoy free edge of videos here so today we're going to be talking about metamax like i actually made a trade on this metamax edge of so literally uh, metamax is valued at seven billion so there's going to be money coming soon right they have a lot of money so and they also announced they might be having a dow and a token launch if they do they're going to be having an airdrop straight up right so in this video we're going to be like having a straight up use of uh metamax to do some transaction i'm gonna show you so i've actually like uh done a trade so people would have actually seen this and uh, i think i must have done this on my other uh wallets like so literally i'm gonna do this wallet because it's in a different uh device we are used to like do these videos right so i'm gonna like do an in-app swap from it to a stable Okay, you have to enable the smart contract so it, the, the glasses are gonna be cheaper right so I'm gonna like choose a stable I'm gonna choose die stable or I'm gonna choose a USDC or a tether right so I'm gonna move it a 0 0.00 okay 0 0.01 is zero five that's fifty dollars five swap to it remember this uses a proxy right which could be uniswap and the rest of it so the gas fee is two dollars maximum fee is five dollars so i'm gonna do this swap right and see how it's going to go new quotes in 19 seconds so preparing to swap it can be it can be very very sluggish right and the price of it is like really down right now so we're waiting for it to finish loading and private transaction was disabled you can still swap your tokens even while trans smart contracts is unavailable right so but without the smart contract it's gonna like cost a lot more to swap this now i have this right i can close this and i have assets on usdc and usdt do you understand that right so next is to swap back definitely this is more like doing volumes so in my other wallets i literally like use uh one thousand five hundred dollars so each swap i makes both forth and backward covers like a two thousand uh or what's it called one thousand dollars to two thousand dollar uh volume on metamax right so literally you can actually do it so i'm just gonna swap back I'm gonna like put up the marks and get them to eat. Fetch them quotes and then the quotes available. I'm preparing to swap and the gas fee is now three dollars. So you literally see that I've actually spent five dollars swapping now and the volume I did here is just hundred dollars. Hundred dollars because I swapped fifty up and I swapped fifty down. That's hundred dollars. So imagine if I have five hundred dollars and I pay gas fee of five dollars, it means that I've swapped five hundred coin, five hundred coin. That's one thousand dollar volume, and you can send back your money to Binance. Then tomorrow you can do the same thing. Just do it for like five days. You literally like spend less than thirty dollars to do it, and then you have um over five thousand volume, and you are practically ready for the airdrop, right? 
so i think i just i was i was just in a hurry i've actually done most of this transaction here literally and i just have to show you with this small amount of money that no matter how small your um, your amount is you can still run it like literally run it do you understand me so um we're going to do the bridge right if you have metamax already installed i have a lot of videos that show how you could install metamax how you could add other chains like binance chains polygon and the rest of them so the swap is complete so we'll have to head over to the bridge and remember to use chain list to add polygon so click on the bridge see this is chain list so you can use it to add uh, avalanche bnb avalanche and polygon you connect your wallet metamax wallet and you just add them now you click on add click on add you click on add it mo it's adds polygon network for you it's add bnb network for you for free right so literally you just have to just go to which is which is what i'm loading right now then we'll bridge from it to bnb from bnb to it it still uses a proxy what i mean by proxy is that metamax do not have its own bridge it uses celebridge it uses uh i hope exchange bridge like anyone that is available at that particular time that could be cheaper that's what he actually uses so um here okay let's connect to metamax So I've actually connected the wallet here. You can see the Ethereum network. So you can select the network we're going to. We select uh, select the network we're going to here. Select Polygon. Select the token. We select uh, Ethereum. And we'll get that wrapped it here. So we can put the amount of 0 0.05 four five we'll move it you see now this is i want you to, just, to understand something the best bridge now that is available right now is hope exchange bridge sometimes you see seller bridge here sometimes you see across bridge sometimes so the bridge differs if you click down here you will see the estimate right then i think there's so choose from different other you see celebridge you see what i'm saying most of them are ch the only cheaper one right now is hope exchange and the time they give is 10 minutes sometimes it's higher than that now polygon pos says 22 minutes sometimes it's higher than that right so literally you're just gonna use submit i'm just gonna like literally submit the transaction right so it's using hope exchange and it gives us 10 minutes so bro we just need to have to like be patient and make sure you have gas on the blockchain you're like withdrawing to right make sure you have matic since we are withdrawing to uh, polygon make sure we have matic on the blockchain so that we can use it to pay for the gas fee to claim it or we can use it to have pay the gas fee to push it back to ethereum mainnet right it's just as simple as that literally so guys that's that about that on ethereum uh metamax a job so with any amount of money you have you can just literally try it out but i will pre i wish you use some bigger phones like 200 to 500 dollars so that each swap you're making even though it's costing you some gas fee but you're literally making adding a lot of volumes to whatever you're doing right so thank you guys for watching this uh particular video and see you in my next video and uh, please hit the subscribe button share the video so that people will see more people will see the video i love you guys like literally see you bye bye